Hi everyone, this is Dave, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you the 2016 12 inch Apple MacBook. This is the built to order Core M7 version with 8 gigabytes of RAM and 512 gigabytes of storage. Now, later on in this video, I'm going to be showing you a 4K video export from Final Cut Pro 10. But before I do that, I want to show you the Blackmagic Design Disk Speed Test so we can see the performance of the internal storage in here. So let's click Start and we can see the write speed is peaking at around about 855 megabytes per second and the read speed completely off the chart at 934 megabytes per second. We'll let it run a second time and you can see we're getting around about the 780 to 820 megabytes per second on the right and peaking at 939 megabytes per second on the read speed. So really good performance when it comes to the actual speed of the internal storage on here. So now let's move across to Final Cut Pro 10. So Final Cut Pro 10 is a really good choice if you're gonna video edit and do anything more than a simple edit. You know, you get iMovie free of charge on here, which is perfectly capable. Final Cut Pro 10 is the editor that I use, and we've got some 4K video footage here that was captured on a Sony uh, camcorder. It was actually captured on the AX53. So we've got 4K video footage, 100 megabits per second, and editing is absolutely fine. We've got no drop frames. We can skip through the footage very, very easily, and everything just goes along at a really nice pace. Now we're gonna actually export this in 4K resolution. So we're gonna to go to share and we're gonna to go to 4K. And we're gonna just give this a, the default name of 4K test. And we're going to go next. Now I'm gonna get a timer up on the screen as well so that we can see exactly how long this takes. I will speed up the video so you don't have to sit through all of this. We're gonna write this just directly to my movies folder and we're going to click save and at the same time i'm going to click start on here so we're ready three two one go now we're just coming up to halfway on the video export and I should mention that this is a 4K UHD resolution file. So that's 3840 by 2160, 25 frames per second. It was captured at 100 megabits per second bit rate. And the actual length of the video we're exporting is one minute, 30 seconds. So we're just coming up to one minute, 30 seconds on the stopwatch. And we're showing at almost 75, 78, 79, 80% on the export. There we go, the video is exported and ready to play back. And we can play this back with Final Cut Pro running in the background. It's nice and smooth. And to export that 4K resolution file, so a full 4K video, one minute 30 in duration, took just one minute 48 seconds. I think that is a fantastic performance and it shows that the 2016 Apple MacBook is more than capable of handling high resolution video editing. So that's it for this video. If you enjoyed it, please do hit that like button, please do subscribe, and I'll see you in another video very soon.